everybody, this is Ryan down here at Bizarre Guitar and Drum in Phoenix, Arizona with another Guitar of the Day. This time we've got a double feature. We've got two guitars that we want to show you. Today we're dealing with the Gibson Les Paul Special Tribute. We've got uh, two different models to show you today, just basically different colors, same guitar. But we couldn't decide on which ones to talk about, so we wanted to show them both to you. Yes. <laughs> well, it sounded like a chicken. <laughs> so yeah, these are both from 2020. They're a brand spanking new, just came off of a UPS truck and landed uh, at our doorstep, just inside our doorstep, of course. <laughs> and actually they weren't <laughs> supposed to be delivered to us, but we're keeping them anyway. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> we'll have to edit that part out, right? Yeah. Um, no. All right, so let's uh, break it down. I guess I'm gonna start with the, uh, the worn white version here. This oh. is... Uh, Go ahead. First of all, you'll notice, of course, uh, that it's got the uh, two P90 pickups in it. That lovely growly P90 sound. And worn white is a new color this year uh, for 2020 as well. Yeah, yeah, it's a um, pretty cool looking guitar. Let's um, see the back. The back. So you can kind of see the grain of the wood through that. that it's white. a nice satin finish, sort of. Yes, both of these are like a satin. Mm -hmm. kind of deal here. Um, this is your usual setup here. It's mahogany body, mahogany neck, rosewood uh, fretboard. Uh, we got these cool little vintage tuners up here too. And uh, what do it sound like, Ryan? Well, let's find out, shall we? So I'm going to switch it over to the neck here. What do the red ones sound like? Shall we switch it over? We shall. All right, here we go. All right, through the magic of television, I'm now holding the red Les Paul special. <laughs> and uh, how of, do you do it? It's pretty magic. Well, you're the one running the camera, so it's it's all down to Greg. I believe it's called holding the phone. Yes. <laughs> pickups and uh, all the same accoutrements as Greg would say um, you got your volume and tone um, it's a nice piece of mahogany let's see the back yeah it very much is it's very nice Gibson's doing some great things these days they are these 2020s uh, are spectacular they've been rolling in we're very excited to, uh, to share them with you as a matter of fact take a quick look won't you everyone <laughs> yeah they're not all over the place Gibson hey let's talk about one more thing Greg because sure. we haven't mentioned this before the wraparound bridge. Mm -hmm. um, so here's what a wraparound bridge is. Get in close and uh, you see that the string is wound actually that a direction and then comes over here. So um, who are big fans of the wraparound bridge on any Les Paul? Your buddy Luther. Luther Governor? Yeah. And you Mick mean Ariel Bender of Mantha Hoople? Yep. Yes. Uh, Leslie West. Leslie West. Now that man had some tone. Uh, Mick Ralphs. Mick Ralphs, the legendary, another Mappa Hoople guy, but also uh, bad company. Don Barnes. I, I, should I know From uh, 38 Special. Ah, uh, Billy Gibbons? Uh, Billy Gibbons probably has a few of those laying around somewhere. Right on. So because of that wraparound bridge, you, you basically you're getting a lot more resonance out of the, is that the, the idea there? Yeah, I mean, the wraparound bridge kind of came into existence before the actual 
ABR1 tailpiece sort of thing. Oh, okay. And then the the thing on those bridges, if you look at the, this one, it's got it's compensated. Back in the old days, they didn't have that compensated, so you can actually get the intonation right on these. Where the older style were just a flat bridge. Oh, so okay. So this is much more better. <laughs> so see, I'm learning stuff on this video. Very there you go. That's right. pretty good because I'm just making it up as I go along. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys very much for tuning in to yet another video down here at Bizarre Guitar and Drum. Let's hear some Mata Hoople on the way out. Some Mata Hoople, oh my God. All the way from Memphis. Oh, that'll I don't be know Luther. How to play that stuff anymore. Oh, oh I could dude. Only, I just know my walking with a mountain. But yeah, so uh, make sure you like and subscribe and do all those things that we normally ask you to do, and we'll see you next time.